Because of the Robin Hood law, Chapter 41 school districts such as Bernie are required to take part in wealth equalization. These districts pay recapture to the state, which then redistributes the wealth to districts with less property value per student. Due to this law, Bernie ISD is unable to match other school districts' average teacher salaries and benefits, which results in understaffed departments and a large student-to-teacher ratio. Uh, first of all, I'm not a fan of the Robin Hood law. No one's really a fan of seeing their money disappear uh, and go elsewhere. Currently, we have to have students who uh, go to their parents to have cast fees or pay for their costumes and things like that, and that's not in line with uh, other schools across the board. Other schools you'll see have, have much larger budgets for activities like theater. With all this information, the question must be asked. How can we compensate for our lost funds and ensure every student receives the best education? After all, we are Bernie. Good morning. Good morning. Good morning. Good morning. I'm Ethan Quintero with uh, BHNN, and I'm here with uh, Thomas Price and Leslie Pickus. What is the main objective for BEF? BEF's job is to provide funding that is above the ISD's normal operating budget. It's also to promote excellence in student achievement and excellence in teaching. Well, and it provides us things that normally we wouldn't be able to afford in our budget above and beyond. When I first moved to Bernie and started teaching at Champion High School, I learned about the Bernie Education Foundation. I have submitted a grant almost every year that I've been here um, because we need a lot of a lot of things for science. Uh, without them, because we have to send so much money back to the state, it, we couldn't do some of the great things that we do in Bernie ISD without the. Uh, you know. Is there anything you'd both like us to know? Any information that I have not asked you about? No, I just want to thank our donors because without them, we wouldn't be helping BISD the way we can. If you look back at the footage, um, our our visits to the the campuses and we surprise the teachers, mm -hmm. and you see the genuine surprise and the enthusiasm in the face of the students and the teachers brought tears to their eyes uh, because this it to them it's really a sign of support. That to me is is the whole essence of everything. That we see. Thank you both for your time, Dr. Price. Well, thank you. Ms. Pickus. Thank you. Have a good day.